Okay. Okay. I have not seen the Moonlight Eclipse before since I was in the eighth grade. Open up a National Geographic for now. Oh my god, it's like looking through a National Geographic. Very is that all? With all its little is that all it is? Oh my gosh. Isn't I thought it was more than that. I thought it was like seeing the whole universe for the first time in our lives. Oh my gosh, but that's what we're seeing when we're seeing what we thought. Well, then I should let you see Saturn's rings then real quick. Oh, you want to see the telescope? You guys looking at the moon? Yeah, and yeah, I'm going to let them look at Saturn's rings too. Really? The Saturn is right here. No way. But so what do we do for that? What do you do for it? We just, well, this is a big old tower. Just let you just stand up for a second. Yeah. And, we'll, yeah. and then while you look, it's quite it's, amazing. Just make sure it's still oh, she's there. She's really nice. Her name's Eva. She won't bite you. She just wants pets. Oh, yeah, I love dogs. Okay. Oh, that's she's great. She's awesome, but what's she? Children see? are. Yeah, wait till you see that. Fearless. That's nothing. Yeah. No, don't, don't touch don't it. Touch it. Don't, it's, don't yeah. touch it. It'll that's just okay. move it. Okay. No problem. Yeah. Just get a little closer. Fine. Can you see? Oh! See? What a great reaction. Yeah. It's just. You find it? See all the craters in it? Oh, my God. Take a peek. Is it really cool? Yeah. So you what? Telescope. That's just a small oh, telescope. You should see it through a big one. Oh my gosh, you really can see all yeah. of this. And you ought to see it in less than 30 like days. It's like the whole real deal. You know what's going to happen with the moon about 30 days from now? Too, Not even like, 25 days. It's going to go across the sun and block it out. Oh, minutes. I know. We're excited. Oh, We're going to watch it from the river instead of going south. Yeah. No, let's just see Saturn's ring real quick. Okay, Saturn's ring. Saturn's ring. Oh, yeah. So it was like in the bottom? Or I'll move the camera. How's this? Just a bit here. Okay. I'll realign it for you. Yeah, it's easy to do. Anybody can set a telescope up like this and do this. It doesn't require any knowledge or maybe a little bit of desire. Yes, motivation and. Yeah. <laughs> so you're touching. Like, oh, I have to align it. He's making it point the right direction. Now, this is the way Galileo first saw Saturn. I want you to see this. It's very no, small. No, I'm, I'm going to put a higher powered eyepiece in the second. I have it told, I used to have a widow's peak that looked a lot like Jack Nicholson. Can you see before. it? You see how small it looks? Okay. <laughs> is it tiny? It looks like a little okay. golden orb with a Saturn? with a ring you're around it. But I'm going to make it bigger. Okay. I want you to see You can just wait there. Just take one second. Dogs and planets. Oh, let's see this too. Okay. Just take a peek. Okay. Let's see. Oh my, thank you. We go way back. Can you see the moon already? All of them. I'm stinky. Oh, wow. That's tiny, but that's oh, my gosh. That's it's a really big. That's the way Galileo first saw it. Real small. Now, do you see the moon? Let's go through it. Yeah. You ugly. Oh, oh, oh. Now it's about. Okay. Okay. Twice the power. Okay. 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 He's, make, he's giving see, it a little more power. You take the lens out to get a easier to see it. There are eyepieces you can change. Yeah, ah. he's got some different Many astronomers someone, have someone like a whole a box of different lights. Let me see. I know he's getting like so you can see it. Bigger. Bigger. It might just be a. It looked like a little, yeah. like a little yeah. eyeball. Yep, he's a snow mango. Yeah, it's like the CBS logo. Cat with spots it's and we miss him. And you know, if you look carefully, no problem. There's a little bright star down below, right? There's a little tiny bright star right below, right? This is. It's moon oh, yeah, Titan. I do see that. And there's, do you it's see the there's largest. a little moon? That's Titan. Down, oh, like it's it's the only moon in the solar system that so has an atmosphere. So the sun is illuminating it, I take it then? It is. Is, you're looking, it's, you're, is well, that what it is? Titan. It's, this it's, is it's the only moon in the solar system with an atmosphere. Saturn? Yeah. And that's it's the second largest. Jupiter has the largest moon, Ganymede. Ganymede which I'll let you see Jupiter's moons too. But, um, yeah. There's a mission out there, the Cassini mission, that's taking close ups of Saturn for the last six, seven, eight years. They're going to let that mission spacecraft dive into the planet. It go through the cloud belt and down. Through, yeah. yeah, and it's going to destroy it, of course. Is it going to try and do some chemical? Yeah, yeah it'll do chemical analysis and photos. And, uh, did you know? Oh, she's not seen this yet. I forgot she hasn't seen Saturn. It's drifting. It's probably drifting oh, off to the left. Did you see Saturn? Name? It's Mark Seibold. Oh, mm -hmm. Oh, my God. Yeah, it's really <laughs> now I just have a picture in there. It's not real, like right? The posters and the... And yeah. the, and the, uh, the uh, oh, yeah, okay. Now I'm some, killing she me. She has the best reaction. I love it. Some people usually say they think it looks fake when they first see it but uh it's you no, should it's see like the hanging mobiles it is saturn yeah it's that's the real deal do you don't mind if i display this i've got you on film saying this i have a thousand uh, friends we've all seen on facebook it's all right yeah you should, I, I it's I way over to the left now it's almost so just out of very oh, that's gently, how can I, yeah. actually it's, oh, yeah it's okay. so minute it'll yeah. just it'll be gone yeah. 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 Yeah.
you have to use your, use your right arm like this. I parsecs and all that. When you do this, on. you put your hand on just very gently and pull it. Well, watch what I do. You just pull it back towards you, just gently. Oh, you pull it back towards Just it. nudge it. Is it the opposite direction? Then? Yeah, it's moving that way in the sky. Okay. But it's going backwards in here. It's going to the left. In an Etonian reflector, everything is backwards and upside down. So. Is it because it's iPhone now? Anyway. I would have taken it just to give it somewhere. No, I'm sorry if I say your name's again. Kelly. Kelly and... Well, this is Joey. Joey, good to meet you. So what did you think of seeing the moon's craters at Saturn? Hey, Jojo, he's asking you a question. What did you think of that? It was interesting. I'm going to see it again. That's good. Yeah. We'll, see some, wow. we'll see some rings. That's incredible, thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. I'm George Fox. George? Yeah. I mean, just, just, like that, a, you should look. just like the university, right? Yes, yeah, exactly. Make sure really? Are you, you related to this I am very much. Because they don't age. Uh, <laughs> I, I know. I, it's the Quaker man, yes. And he's just making sure you can see it. Yeah, he yeah. bumped it. Me and Mel House, we had something on. Okay. All right, let's take a moment. And what's your name? It's Mark Seibold. Mark Seibold? Seibold, it's S-E-I-B-O-L-D. You can look at all these. I have albums on Facebook with all this, all the pictures, Ooh. and we're still lining it up. Still lining it up. Um, S I E. S E I. S E I. Okay. Yeah, it's German. B O L D. Yeah, yeah. And nice. you'll see it come up. You'll, you'll see a picture of my first wife and I in the gorge photographing the solar eclipse in 1979. Wow. Is a cover photo there, and it shows me in the single profile with the smaller computerized motorized telescope with the Lovejoy comet in the sky and the and the eclipse. I composited it all together just as a, an interesting profile. So if you look carefully at Saturn's rings, you can see a little dark line in the outer edge. Yeah. Not the space between the ring and the planet that everybody notices right away. That's the first thing people say is, oh, I can see the, the gap between the ring and the planet. But even more so in the rings themselves, there's rings within rings. And if we magnify it even just a bit more, I'll show you this. I'll even go up a little more in magnification so you can see this bigger yet. It's going to make it even bigger. So I'm going to oh. dial it in and you're going to make it yeah, so this easier is, to see. And meanwhile, there's a dog. People will ask me how powerful uh, this telescope is. Call will. me uh, when it's ready because I'm going to go. Okay, <laughs> it'll just be one second. I'll call you in one second or a few seconds. That's good. Okay. She's got a great uh, uh, character. Yes, she does. I don't see kids that age with that much patience. Wow, well, there's that. <laughs> it's really amazing. She's not left handed, is she? No, no. Yeah, I'm a left handed. No, she's got a cousin. Right. Oh no, you meant, you meant. Oh yeah. To write with. Mm -hmm. okay. So now you can see the Cassini division in the outer edges of the ring. Oh, about Eva, a, don't go in there. About She's just sniffing She's just sniffing. Yeah, that'd be so awesome. if you carefully look at this, Were you looking under, um, you'll actually no. see several more of Saturn's yeah. moons. Yeah. You really look so carefully and take a few extra yeah, seconds. Right but so, you have to be seated. Okay. Just shut. You can just stand. You have to stand. Just peek in there. And, and kind of just mic? keep the street light out of your eyes yeah. by putting your hand cover over the top your, of your cover right over your eyebrows. Yeah. Yeah. You don't want to touch it. What kind of what is it? French tripod. What kind of tripod? And, yeah. Oh, it's a Gitzo. G I T Z O. It's and French. Is it like a metal? Or it's like a crackle gray finish. It looks like steampunk. That's okay. why it, it got stolen because as soon as people saw it, they just took it. It looks like a used Rolls Royce car sitting with the keys in it. It's not going to come back, I don't How think. How tall is it? Oh, I like this one. Right. Similar to this one you see with... And what's the brand? Gitzo. G I. Oh, yeah, it says it right on there several times okay. in oh kind gosh. of block letters. G-I-T-Z-O. It's made in France by 1970. They go for about $200 a week. And I left That's it here a couple amazing. nights ago. Yeah, I mean... Does it look I didn't like look this? This is a little later, shiny. So. Oh, okay. So Can I look? That's not it. No, that's, okay. a, that's a modern thing made in the last couple that's of years. That's what I thought. Chinese it was So yours look, does it look old? It's, it's got so separate awesome. legs with no brace in it. And so. it's uh, brown, or round legs. It's got black yeah. okay. It's got little, little uh, okay. thumb rolled screws on two okay. sets of legs that expand out. It's very old fashioned. So it doesn't have the middle, the little middle thing that sticks down? Oh, yeah. It's got a. It, yeah. Oh. oh, but no brace. Oh, yeah. It'd be real dark. Okay. And this has, it has a, like a light green plastic handle here on the pan head. And it's got many little knobs, little green plastic knobs, little green, green plastic, like light green or dark green. Light green with little knobby yeah, things on them. Nice. It looks really old fashioned. It would look like something. So see, it doesn't. Okay. It doesn't have those support pieces yeah. in the middle like that. Because yeah. I'm just going through Craigslist and just. Oh, that's just people selling them. Yeah. Yeah, but someone might have found oh it. Oh my God! And it could be. I can tell you, they're not going to give it up. 
It'd be like if you, like I said, you found a used roll. Be like, hey, I left yeah, mine. This is it. Oh, you know, gone. would you be willing yeah. to give it back to me? It happens I'll so quickly. That'd I know. Be nice. I'd like to do that. Uh, some people said I should do that. Right. It's yeah. worth I messaging guess, because if someone just too. found yeah. it and they're just trying to make some money, exactly. even getting Sweet. twenty bucks for your so, vintage. You know, I just heard a story tonight. Go ahead and tell you. Kind of, well, Maybe. the kind of people that would find oh. it. You got to use it for guess what? Three people that come up here. They're gonna pawn it for substance. Yeah, there's a lot of us that would really suck. You know what? Actually, a bunch of stuff. I would have taken it home. I heard a story. I heard a story tonight of a person who was on the max a year ago, and they said we need to disembark. Blah, blah, blah. And the guy forgot that he had his bike on there. And once he remembered, it was long gone. Yeah. Thanks for and for the and, and, and he um, yeah, just today saying. got a call from Portland Parks and Rec who found his bike. Wow. The serial number located him That's because nice. he had yeah. it. Well, there are good people in the no, world. No, but you're saying like that. The guy, the guy yeah. who had stolen it or taken it, yeah. Down below right just like, stuck down for around the entire planet. The thing is, is the guy who had taken it specs, improved specs, it, specs, put on all new like and much better components. Mm -hmm. So he has a better bike than he started out with a year ago today. Wow, that's amazing. He got it. But how did they get They rebuilt it. They, rebuilt it. they oh, added really? all kinds of stuff. That's amazing. That's a great story. Right? Um, that. What well, was the name again? Gitso. Gitso, Gitso, Gitso. Yeah. So okay. you might as well register it because you never know at what point mm -hmm. it could come back to you. Register. And yeah, when I mean, you with, it, the, you with mean, the with the you know police to everyone. say this is and a And thank you for sharing your. Telescope yeah, with us. Oh, you're welcome. Made my evening, my right up. Yay! Hey, I George. know. I'll see you again. <clears throat> is it possible to take a picture of the of the Saturn? Oh, oh you, the, you can. A lot of people try to float their iPhone over, but it, right. it just it wanders all over and goes right. blurry. But yeah, you should just try. look. You should look for. I, so I don't think you've seen it yet. Have you? I did. I saw it, and then just yeah, sit if, down. Yeah, if you're yeah. Seated, and you crown the light out of your brow of your eye without touching the scope, but just gently holding your hand over your to keep the street lights out. You'll notice as your eye wanders around the planet. There's a very bright starlight object yeah, below right. I see that. That's Titan, Saturn's largest moon. There's several more little fleeting specks. They're very faint little fleeting specks that across in front of you here. And it has many more moons you can see actually than Jupiter, even though Saturn's twice the distance. That's you're, amazing. you're seeing its light taking an hour and a half to come an back hour. to our eyes from its reflecting of sunlight. Where Jupiter is only 45 minutes light distance. You're looking at Saturn, not the way it looks now, but the way it looked an hour and a half ago. Although it's not really changed. And its moons have moved a little bit in their orbits around Saturn, but we, did, so we don't amazing. notice that in, in casual observation. Thank you so much for setting this. Did you build this? No, but everybody asks it. It's a, Dob yeah. it's a Dobsonian design, but it's, it was a commercial construction. And, uh, awesome. But I'll... Uh,